This video shows how to unbox and set up the HP LaserJet Pro M501 printer. This printer is heavy. HP recommends using a cart or dolly to move it to the setup location. Place the box on a flat, smooth surface. Open it by breaking the tape on the top and folding back the flaps. On the top of the packing material, you'll find the following items. A setup guide. It's the basic step-by-step -step guide for setting up your printer, much like this video. A getting started guide, which helps you install and set up the software. Instructions for taking the printer out of the box. The printer's warranty. And a multi-language support guide with phone numbers and websites for contacting HP technical support. When you have removed these items, pull up on the cardboard flap to access the pocket containing the power cord. Make sure you only use this power cord with your printer. If you misplace it, order a new one from HP or your HP retailer. And the installation CD. Go to 123.hp.com forward slash laserjet to download the software and drivers for your printer. The installation CD allows access to the user guide, warranty information, and software. Note that a USB cable and an Ethernet cable do not come with your printer. If you plan to use either to connect the printer to your network, you will have to buy it separately. Now, take the printer out of the box. Lay the box on its side so the base of the printer is at the bottom. Reach into the box, grasp the plastic packaging material, and pull the printer out of the box. You might need someone to hold the box in place while you pull the printer out. Set the box aside. Remove the end caps. Take the printer out of the protective bag. Lift the ends of the printer, slide the bag off, and set it aside. Remove the packing tape. Now load the paper. Pull the paper tray out of the printer. Slide the paper width and paper length guides out as far as they will go. For legal size paper, pull the tray extension out. Flex the stack of paper to break any locked edges that could cause jams. Tap the paper on a flat surface to make sure that the edges are aligned and even. Load the paper so the top of the page goes into the printer first. Make sure that the stack of paper is not higher than the marks on the paper tray guides. Slide the paper length and paper width guides inward until they stop at the edges of the paper. Do not push the guides so far in that they bend the paper. Push the paper tray back into the printer until it stops. If you need instructions for loading the multi-purpose tray, go to www.hp.com forward slash support forward slash LJM501. Locate the power connector on the rear of the printer. Plug the power cord into the power connector. Make sure the plug is firmly in place. Plug the other end of the power cord into a power source. HP recommends that you plug the printer directly into a wall outlet, not a power strip. Also, make sure that your power source meets the printer's minimum voltage requirements. You'll find them on the product label on the rear of the printer. To take advantage of the printer's job storage printing capability, insert a USB thumb drive into the USB port. Make sure the drive is a USB 2.0 or later with at least 16 gigabytes of memory. If you are connecting your printer to an Ethernet network, connect an Ethernet cable to the Ethernet port on the rear of the printer. Plug the other end of the cable into a hub or switch that's connected to your system's network port. On the front of the printer, press the power button to power on the printer. The printer will make some noise while it initializes. Wait until the printer is idle and silent before continuing with the setup. This might take a few minutes. When the initialization is complete, Find the control panel on the right side of the printer. Remove the protective film from the display. The first thing you'll see on the control panel is the language setup screen. Note for these instructions we will set up the printer for English. Press the arrow buttons to scroll to your language. Press OK. Press OK again to confirm your selection. Press the arrow buttons to scroll to your country or region. Press OK. Press OK again to confirm your selection. On the default settings screen, press the arrow buttons to select whether you want to manage the printer yourself or have your IT department do it. Press OK and then press OK again to select Yes. If the printer is connected to a network, 
the IP address appears automatically on the control panel. Go to 123.hp.com forward slash laserjet to install the printer's software on your computer. This has been the unboxing and setup video for the HP LaserJet Pro M501 printer.